All right, and welcome back to Guardians of the Galaxy episode three. More than a feeling, I believe. I accidentally previously started. on Guardians of the Galaxy. Hey guys, and welcome. Let's go. You don't know a lot about me, but before I met you guys, there was someone. She's gone now, but maybe with that relic I can make her ungone. I know you've got a lot on your mind. That kid you fought, maybe he does too. Promise me in the future you'll use your words instead of your fists. I will, Mom. I promise. Thank you, baby. The Eternity Forge resides here, pending such time as it can be wielded responsibly. Until then, she shall remain entombed across the galaxy. Come find me, Peter. I'll be waiting for you. I'll be waiting for you. My words exactly. Yeah, we get out of this whole crap. Wow, look at that energy. Nice. Even though it's green, you know. You're nearly there, Peter. Where is she going? Where is he going? I got it, Mom. Thanks, Thanks baby. baby. Another headache? Just, Just a little one. Stop, Stop worrying. worrying. It's fine. Just took, took me by surprise. surprise. Didn't look like a little headache. Nothing I can't handle. Especially with you looking out for me. I better get that prescription before the pharmacy closes. Stay out of trouble till I get back, okay? Be good. I know that's not always easy for you. Aww. Where's the fun in that? Being good can be fun too. <laughs> Give me one example. I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> I'll be back soon. I'll get back. Hey, Pete. Hi. Hey, Mr. Pinkle. Here to get that mixtape copy? Yeah. Sure is a nice thing to do for your mom. How's she doing, anyway? She's not doing so well. I'm sorry to hear that, Pete. Well, I'm sure this is gonna make her feel a lot better. Music's got some powerful mojo. Both sides? Come back in about an hour, and it'll be ready. Hey, Petey! You make that mix for your boyfriend? <laughs> So what if I did? You got some kind of problem with that? I got a problem with you. Afraid I'm gonna break it again? <laughs> you afraid I'm gonna hit you again? <laughs> Listen to you. Pretending you got balls. Hey, how's that lip doing? Give me that. What are you doing here anyway? You don't have money. Everyone in town's talking about it. Your mom can't even pay her medical bills. 
She's been going door to door asking for help, like some pathetic loser. She's probably off looking for change in the sewers right now. Yeah, maybe she'll get lucky and find a quarter. Come on. Let's not do this, man. Do what? We're just talking. You gonna cry now? Huh? You done yet? Elephant ears? You must get great reception with those things. Nah, I'm not done. But your mom? She sure is. My dad goes drinking with her doctor. Told him everything. Guess she didn't feel like it was important enough to tell you. Oh, check it out! Dead woman walking! What's the point? Drugs ain't gonna help. My dad says you're gonna die anyway. Where'd you get those bruises, huh? Your dad? Or does your mom have a good swing too? I'm gonna go to your funeral just to see your son cry. Get out! My dad's gonna- Out! You kept your promise. You didn't fight that jerk. I'm proud of you, Peter. Even though I didn't set a very good example. Mm -hmm. The things he said. I let my emotions get the better of me. Clarence is an idiot. I don't care what he says. You were real strong there, kiddo. He said you were dying, Mom. Is that true? Find me, please. You're so close, Peter. What? No! I wanted to see that! <sighs> what the? More than a feeling, like I How said. How did I get home? Hey. <laughs> Are you okay? This temple is really messing with my head. Hello, Gamora. Whoa! Hey, Gamora! Come on, what are you doing? You can do better than that. Back off, Gamora. Seriously. Stop it! Come on, this isn't fair! I don't have a sword! <laughs> hey! Um. Hey! Wait! Gamora! Oh god, smash that button! Smash that button! Smash, smash, smash! Focus, Nebula. You need to be aware of everything around you. Perception's just as important as strength and speed. None of them are important when I'm stuck here. I want to use what you've taught me somewhere outside of this room. I'm sick of just doing the same thing over and over, every single day. Be patient, Nebula. You'll get your chance soon enough. So now I need patience, too? <laughs> Looks like you've lost your touch. <laughs> Hardly. Was 
actually a little impressive. <laughs> Just a little? Come on. I can't. Gamora, you're hurting me. Father. Nebula, you have grown so much. Father. You may yet be the greatest assassin in the galaxy. Don't you agree, Gamora? <laughs> Well, she does have the best teacher. I wouldn't expect anything less. And yet Nebula is the one who disarmed you. Perhaps the teacher might learn from the student. I have a mission for you. You will go to a Kree outpost on the planet of Phalion. There you will find General Tarval. He has come into possession of something I require. A device. Gamora. You will fetch the device for me. You, Nebula. You will kill the General. Thank you, Father. I, I promise you, I will succeed. I know you will, daughter. Gamora. You are always my favorite. But you have become cold, distant. Forcing me to look to Nebula to tighten the slack. Whether I believe she's capable or not. Father, I don't think this is a good idea. Nebula isn't ready. She's impulsive, reckless. Do not question my judgment. You have lost any confidence I had in you. Go and prepare. You will head out immediately. And Gamora, I know you no longer care. But if you fail, your sister will pay for your missteps. Tell Nebula I wish to speak with her. Is everything all right? What's going on? I couldn't hear you, but Father... He didn't look happy. Everything is fine. Don't worry about it. Everything's fine. That's not what it looked like. Nebula! Come here! I guess this is it. My chance to prove myself. Or fail miserably. <sighs> Don't worry, Nebula. I've got your back. No. I've got to do this myself. It's what I've been training for. I won't let Father down. Let's just do this.
Nebula! Nebula, are you all right? Are you hurt? Why? Why did you do that? What? I had him. That was my kill and you took it from me! Seriously? Father will be so upset with me. I won't tell Thanos, I promise. We'll keep it to ourselves. Give me the device. Nebula, what are you doing? You took my kill. Give me the device in exchange. Give it to me, now! I'm not asking here. Do it! Fine, here. Hey, it's going to be fine. We're going to be okay. Son of a bitch. One minute you and I were walking into the temple, and the next yeah, I was... Yeah, I, uh... I know. Wait, were you... Did you see all that? My memory? Are you okay? I've been trying not to think of that day. Because I really want to fix things with Nebula. But seeing that... She thought I was being selfish. Taking away everything she worked so hard to achieve. That's why she turned on me. And why she'll never forgive what I did. She tried to kill you. There is no excuse for that. Look, if anyone deserves to hold a grudge, it's you. That's not how Nebula sees it. That last moment, it became everything. All I remembered of her. There were times we were happy, despite Thanos, despite everything. We had each other. Maybe, maybe I could have done more. Been more honest with how I was feeling. I know you, Gamora. And I know you tried your absolute best to protect her. If Nebula can't see that, then that's her problem. Not yours. Is it? Nebula is who she is because of me. That hatred, that coldness, her inability to trust anyone. She is Thanos' daughter. Who else could she be after I betrayed her? I failed her. Listen to me. You? didn't fail her. You don't fail at anything. You are the strongest person I know, okay? And I respect the hell out of you for that. And I don't just mean the ass-kicking. 
I mean, believe me, you kick some serious ass. I do kick a lot of ass, huh? Hell yeah, you do. Now, come on. Let's figure out why the Forge brought us here before things get even more... weird. Oh, man. My mom loved this song. She played that record non-stop. Peter, wait. This place... It seems to be using our memories against us. We don't know what we'll find inside. Or why it's been drawing us here. Yeah, well, if anything goes wrong, you'll be here to protect me, right? You're not saying anything, and it's super worrying. Gamora, seriously? Hmm. <laughs> This place? Yeah. This is where my mom. Uh, this is where I saw her last. I don't know what all this means, Peter. But I hope somehow you get your mom back. Thanks for, uh, for understanding. She's your family. Your real family. I know how much she means to you. Where the hell are we now? Millennia. What? 
How do you know who I am? We have met. But I was not me. Say what? I'm confused. Whoa! Thank you. May I borrow that? You're gone. It will only be for a moment. Uh, yeah, sure. What? I have another one. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. It is so wonderful to be free of that tomb. No longer trapped in my own mind. Alone. So tell me, tell us, how do you know? You are truly the hero the legends foretold. What legends? So brave and handsome. Though. Perhaps not in the classical sense. What? Ha! You must have many questions for me. Um... Take your time. So these, uh, legends about me, what are they? I mean, I know a few already, but, uh, this one might be new. You don't know? Oh, how unexpected! I have been waiting for you all this time. The moment you touched the forge, I knew you were the Celestial One, that you could free me. So I reached out to you the only way I could, through your memories. The ones most vivid to you. But you must understand, I had no control over them. I... <laughs> you like my abilities. Most people run away from me. There's still time. <laughs> how could you possibly know how he feels? I can show you, angry lady. Oh. No. Never mind. May I show you? Please. I mean no harm. Watch. Do it again! Do it again! Come on! With great pleasure! Oh, this isn't going to go well. What emotion was that? I do not believe I should say out loud. Sexual. You see, I am an empath. I can read the emotions of others. It is my duty to help the Celestial One decide the fate of the Forge. That could really come in handy. Oh, she's got to meet the rest of the group. Yeah. Introduce an emotionally charged being to a group who are emotionally sensitive. Mm -hmm. Who should we try on first? I got just the one. <laughs> this is gonna be exciting. I can't wait. <laughs> Alright guys, and thank you for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, I really appreciate all the support you've given us, uh, please comment, like and subscribe for more awesome content, and please also check out all of these thumbnails around me for more fantastic content from projects, alright, alright, and until the next time, bye bye.